Hi Aquarius, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot. And I'm here to do your reading for May. This is for Aquarius Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. This is for the month of May. Any time in May could resonate. The day you watch it, who knows? May not resonate at all. This is for Aquarius. What's coming for the month of May? The Emperor. The Emperor. This is an Aries. It doesn't have to be an Aries, but this is a very dominant individual who is very protective. This is a protector. Um, very structured, organized individual. The boss, the father. We have a very, this is a very wise man right here. So wise exciting we have an exciting new opportunity here this is an you may receive an invite or you may extend an invite this is an invitation this is good news this is good news coming in oh my god happiness this is happy this is bliss a feeling of warmth a feeling of peace even it just it feels really good look at the birds i mean it's beautiful. It's a beautiful time. It really is. Oh, things are happening fast, Aquarius. Wow. There's, there's, there could be somebody rushing into your life, or you could be rushing into somebody's life like wildfire. Okay. I mean, there's a lot of, there's fire here. Okay. There is, this is all fire. Okay, this is all this is all fire. This whole top. So things, some it's like the it's lit. <laughs> it really there. There's the wildfire in the back. I didn't even see it. I didn't see it until just now. Son of a bitch. I had to say it at that point. Okay, so it is. We got a wildfire here. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my God, it's going to be a fire. You probably might have to call in the troops to put it out. <laughs> anyway, I just pictured this with the, with the, uh, you know, the planes going to put out the fires. And you see the stuff underneath the trees. So yeah, it's on. It's on like, uh, this is a wild fire. <laughs> you. Okay. You, if you are single, you probably won't be single for long. If you are in a coupled relationship, you may thinking about you may be thinking about breaking free, but I don't know. This is soulmate connection here. We have a soulmate connection. We do. This is like a past life relationship, or somebody that you've known for a really long time, maybe a childhood, somebody that you've known for years and years and years. Mm -hmm. Page of Cups reversed. This is this is getting some relief. You probably are going to be getting some relief, Aquarius. I have to be honest with you. Um, taking that next step. And <laughs> right into love. Oh, my God, Aquarius. You're getting the oh, my gods, too. Imagine that. So, yeah, uh, this is love. This is this is great. This is a new opportunity for love. You, I see you guys taking a step that you probably were, you may have been reluctant to take, but I don't think you're going to, uh, no. I think it's the, the reluctant period is over. I see you guys taking that step. You may have tried to hide your emotions. You might have tried to push down your emotions, but this is so attractive. It's so exciting. It's so vibrant to you. It's so... Uh, passionate you it's like you can't you can't stop yourself I, whatever it is it's like you got to go it's like you got to take that step so I, I just feel as though you guys probably are receiving something a good offer something that this person is really whoever this is this person is perfect for you it's, a, it's somebody that's well suited for you somebody that can make you extremely happy Okay, so if you have been single and you have been waiting, be get prepared right now, because like I said, it's it's gonna be like a wildfire. So, um, yeah, exactly. So anyway, there's an opportunity for love here. Um, 
and you are you, this is the approach position you should go go forward follow your heart follow your heart follow your heart you know it's time it's time to take that next step over the edge You, you can adapt to the new situation. You will be able to adapt just fine. I feel like you've been, maybe you, things have been a little chaotic in your life and you've had, a, maybe you've been a little busy or whatnot and you've been putting love on the back burner, but now it's like, boom, something has happened. Ooh, yeah. I see exactly what has happened. There's an attraction here that is undeniable that you can't deny. That's what's going on here. So it looks to me like you guys are absolutely lit and you're probably, uh, you probably are, uh, you have these desires. I mean, these, this is desires. So, you know, I see, I see a lot of passion here, a lot of sexual energy that could, um, be being acted upon. Okay, I see that you are ready to take a next step and probably face your demons, face your fears. Um, I think that you're really tempted to just go after whatever it is that you are emotionally drawn to. I think that you prob this this is a magnetic connection that is undeniable. It's undeniable. Um, and you may, I mean, this is breaking free. This is liberation from a, a difficult mental conflict that you have been holding on to. So this is letting go of your... This is your own negative mentality. It really is. Standing up. Starting over. Absolutely. This is absolution. Awaken, awakening. We have an awakening here. Some sort of realization that it is time to start over. It is time to live again. It is time to rise from the ashes and take action. So I see you guys moving in a new direction like, whoo, just like that. Like things are happening fast. Now this is some sort of revelation epiphany that it's time to this is liberation to break free perhaps from a toxic in in situation you know you may have been attached to a toxic situation and you're deciding to liberate yourself from it and that could be fears i mean the devil is is ruled by the shadow with the hidden you know the ego you know um so you may be breaking free from your ego Breaking free from the shackles that have kept you down, the shackles that have kept you down, and deciding it is time to live again. So, yeah, I see you guys taking action in a new direction, heading right towards a really, really happy situation that <sighs> involves some really good sex and some love, too. So, I mean, that's what I see for me. I see you guys... Um, you could be uh, reconciling with somebody from your past. This could be a past life. This is a past, both of these cards, this is like a past life partner. You've known this person before. It's like you've known each other in different lifetimes, both these cards together. That's what that tells me. So this is a connection like no, and it really is a connection like no other. It really, really is. So... Um, I think that you may realize that. You may realize that this is a connection like no other. And there's no turning back now. I feel like you are taking control. Somebody is. Whether it's you or the other person, so that emperor is taking control. So we do have somebody here that's about to take control of their desires. Take control of their wishes. Take control of their dreams. Take control of the situation completely. And really kick it into high gear so I see something being kicked into high gear and it's gonna be uh, amazing okay it looks like it's gonna be um, more fire it is definitely be, there's gonna there's a lot of passion this month for you Aquarius a lot of passion 
Um, I see you, you just taking that step <laughs> right into love. So you may, you may be taking that first step that make that brings you, may start out as sex and you fall in love. So anyway, Aquarius, that's what I got for the month of May. Have fun. Good luck.